Aloha, my name is Jewel Tuitele. I'm the president of the board of directors for Angel Network Charities Incorporated. We're here today to tell you a little bit about our organization, what our mission is, and where are we going, what our future is. Angel Network Charities has been uh, organized for almost 30 years, and we are located here on Kalane Anaoli Highway. We are a mission of Calvary by the Sea, Lutheran Church. Our main purpose, our mission, is food service. We provide food for anyone from anywhere. It's a variety of canned foods, produce, proteins. We have been so blessed to have organizations that have supported us from the beginning and continue to support us. Thank you to the Hawaii Food Bank. Thank you to Aloha Harvest. Thank you to the many, many small companies and supermarkets that donate food for us, or they donate funds so that we can purchase food at a very good discounted price. So that is our main mission. Aloha, uh, my name is Leah Del Castillo. I am the oldest member on the board of Angel Network Charities and one of the longest serving members. One of the primary reasons we joined Calvary was because of Angel Network Charities. We said, hey, this is the place for us because we know if, when we give a do donation, we know where our money's gonna go. Um, right to the homeless. Today, we're surviving COVID. <laughs> We've kept going. I wanna say that the biggest change that we experienced was the amount of people that we're helping now. Before the pandemic, I was still in like school, high school, so I didn't get a chance to come um, come over here as often as I do now. We would only have maybe a hundred at our maximum of households, but now we're actually reaching well above that um, in the thousands, kind of. In each car, we may have two or three different households picking up uh, food for for you know three or four different families. We must have hit a peak of about 11 to 1200 families a week serving Thursday and Friday food distributions. We have about 30 volunteers and we work very hard packing the, the food, distributing the food, and thanking the families that do come. We had to immediately uh, redesign our organization very, very quickly to accommodate the new amount of people that were coming. You know, 8,000 pounds was what we would distribute in a week, like for two days. Now, we are distributing 25,000 pounds of food each day. So that's 50,000 pounds of food in a week. I think that faith-based action, not just hoping things will get better, but doing something about it is what um, <laughs> Angel Network has always been about. And I think that is what has helped us to continue through these hard times of COVID. We've definitely had our setbacks, but, but we're still here. We'll, we're still serving and we're going strong. Yes, yes, so Angel Network has been a blessing, has been a, I would say, making the invisible kingdom visible, is how I would put it. And, and I think Angel Network Charities offers that kind of visibility to see this is what it looks like for people from all backgrounds and ages and genders and identities to come together and serve the community as one people. I interact with the people a lot and I get to know a lot of the people coming in stories and like just to know uh, how exactly we're helping them so much and that they actually appreciate it makes me feel like I'm not just doing this just to be here. What I'm doing is actually helping. We have people who've been recipients of the food bank who then want to pay it forward. They come and volunteer their time with us. It's just a great place to be and to serve. And here at Angel Network, we always say we're giving a hand up, not a hand out. 
So, you know, we really are trying to give back to the community and to help better the lives of the people here on Oahu. Right now, we have started kind of going back to normal with um, people going back to work and getting their jobs back, which is an amazing thing. Um, but since that's happening, we've also lost um, volunteers who would come in usually. So that's volunteers coming in is always welcome. If we are always looking for donations, whether that's of your time, whether that's food, non-perishable food items, or toiletries, we're always in need of that. If we can get a financial donation of any sort, no matter how small or how large, it helps us tremendously. We now have a very simple way to do that. You just text ANC to 41444, and it's a very simple uh, donation process, and you know that would be awesome if we could you know, get some more donations through money, food, or time. So, in closing, I would like to thank everyone, everyone that's involved, everyone that's taking the time to view this. Uh, we have many, many ways with which you can donate. Just log on to our website. It'll be posted at the end of the video. Please like us or friend us so you get all of the updates. We update it weekly. Thank you. Thank you to the community. Thank you to all of our helpers and our volunteers. And last but not least, thank you to our guests. Thank you for the people that continue to depend on us. We will be here for you. So thank you. Thank you for your time. Thank you for all you do. Aloha.